हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज संजय कदम एंड यू आर वाचिंग माय चैनल स्कॉलर्स पॉइंट टुडे वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द नेचुरल मेथड्स ऑफ असेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इन प्लांट्स एज वी नो देर आर टू मेथड्स असेक्शुअल एंड सेक्शुअल मेथड ऑफ रिप्रोडक्शन इन प्लांट्स बट a sexual method have two types natural methods including budding fragmentation zoospore formation binary fission etc while vegetative methods include including uh, some methods like cutting grafting bud grafting or also called budding then layering etc here we will study now natural methods of asexual reproduction first method is budding now we will study about the budding budding in east in case of east east is a unicellular fungus and east shows unicellular budding while hydra is a animal showing multicellular budding means budding have two types unicellular and multicellular budding here unicellular budding occurs in east how it occurs here there is a east cell this is the east cell unicellular cell it forms a bud like this bud is an outgrowth like structure formed by a parent cell of east and in this way a nucleus divided goes to this outgrowth like structure and in this way yeast cell forming one outgrowth that is called bud this bud grows rapidly and in this way this new bud also forming new bud this new bud grows forming again new bud in this way a chain of bud is formed here this is the chain 1 2 3 in this way buds when become full grown then it forms again new buds this budding goes on and within short period we can get a lot of yeast cells and in this way yeast reproduces asexually by budding okay friends this is all about budding a sexual reproduction is always a rapid method and into which mitosis occurs and by this method parent cells are forming exactly similar daughter cells that is why yeast cell forming exactly similar new cells in a chain like manner means these genetically and morphologically identical cells are called clones means cells produced by asexual reproduction or organisms produced by asexual reproduction are also called clones because they are genetically similar to parents means new organisms offsprings are genetically similar to parent okay now second second method is fragmentation in fragmentation it is also a rapid method found in spirogyra spirogyra is a type of 
alga a ribbon like alga like this somewhat flat ribbon like structure and the spirogyra having a spiral chloroplast that is why called spirogyra and uh, this parent spirogyra because of some reasons its main filament ribbon like structure broken down into two or many pieces like this here this parent spirogyra broken down here again here and in this way we have one fragment this one is another fragment okay and this one is the last fragment okay and in this way there are three fragments means three pieces of parent spirogyra by fragmentation these pieces are formed and each piece means each fragment gives rise to new spirogyra it grows each fragment have ability to grow and forming new spirogyra plant okay and in this way there is a formation of 1 2 and 3 new spirogyra algae from one parent alga by method fragmentation means piece making pieces are formed 1 2 and 3 and each fragment each piece gives off new spirogyra very rapidly okay then the third method of natural method of asexual reproduction is zoospore formation spore formation or here we can say zoospore formation in case of clemi domonas is a microorganism into which zoospore means motile movable spores are formed these spores have a flagella hair like structures by which they show movement that is why motile spore zoon means animal and zoospore means moving spores because uh, fungi and other uh, lower plants forming spores non motile but here in chlamydomonas zoospores are motile spores flagellated spores okay parent chlamydomonas suppose this one is the parent chlamydomonas parent cell forming this parent cell forming small zoospores inside okay 1 2 3 4 5 and so on each zoospore develops small hair like structures called flagella inside okay in this way there are few zoospores okay and this parent cell also considered as zoo sporangium as it forms zoospores that is why called zoosporangium one zoosporangium means one one parent cell 
producing few spores like this okay one two and so on and when the zoo spores released out from zoo sporangium means this parent cell now they come out from parent cell or zoo sporangium and they are now free as they have a flagella they are motile and in this way they can move from one place to another place they grow into new chlamydomonas in this way one parent chlamydomonas produces few new chlamydomonas in this way this is the zoo spore formation method in microscopic organisms like chlamydomonas then last method is called fission and there are two types of fission fission means what division simple a microscopic cells divide by this method called fission f i double -E s i o n and fission have two types binary fission into which one parent cell producing two daughter cells or one parent organism produces two daughter organisms that is called binary fission occurs in amoeba then uh, paramecium euglena while multiple fission into which one parent organism produces many small parent organisms like one amoeba produces many amoebae or one plasmodium produces many plasmodia in this way either binary or multiple fission occurs depends upon the conditions either they may be favorable or unfavorable here we will learn about the binary fission occurs in unicellular organisms like amoeba euglena paramecium okay now take example of amoeba suppose amoeba is a microscopic organism it has a regular shape irregular shape okay now this is the parent amoeba its first nuclear division occurs parent amoeba undergo nuclear division and in this way it forms two daughter nuclei two daughter nuclei in this way one nucleus forming two nuclei by nuclear division again the plasma membrane or cell membrane invaginates and in this way cytoplasm is divided and in this way by cytoplasmic division this parent amoeba forming like this here there is a notch or furrow like structure form so as to separate two structures and in this way when the two structures are join they get separated and in this way we get one and two separated cells two daughter amoebae in this way one parent amoeba first 
divide by nucleus and then by cytoplasm and we get the two daughter amoebae one organism forming two organisms by binary fission by means two in fission means in a microscopic cell division two organisms produced by one organism it is a rapid method and in this way two daughter amoebae are exactly similar like the parent amoebae in this way amoeba never dies it is immortal biologically okay okay now friends we learn about four types of natural methods of asexual reproduction first was budding in rows then sorry budding in yeast second fragmentation in spirogyra then zoospore formation in chlamydomonas and binary fission in amoeba in the same manner amoeba have a irregular binary fission euglena have a longitudinal binary fission while paramecium have transverse binary fission and plasmodium and amoebae also undergo <coughs> multiple binary uh, multiple fission by which they produce many new organisms but of small size again okay in this way in asexual reproduction organisms reproduce rapidly as compared to sexual reproduction okay thanks 